what's going on. I just want to show you. I know I, I'm special right now. I just spit everywhere. That was great. Okay. Just want to show you my cute little outfit. It's very cute. <laughs> like a little bear. Um, I actually can't move that because it's like hanging by a thread. It could fall off at any second. I just thought I would look in here for some little ears. You know, what is this? Ooh, are these like little hand thingies? Adorable. Let's see if there's another one. Anyways, I was doing this for Patreon and then I had to take a little break because uh, I had to find the rest of the outfits. I was like, why don't I just do this for YouTube? This part anyways. If you want to see me trying to squeeze into this, you can head on to Patreon to see it. But I'm not really trying to promote myself. I mean, yes, of course, always. We're trying to always promote ourselves. But that's not the point. You can support me by just watching my things on here. It doesn't have to be like super, you know, fancy style. I need... Oh, look, I have a tail. I could have a tail if I wanted to. But I feel like I don't need a tail with this. Like if I wanted to be... Huh. Why isn't it working? It's kind of hard to use. I don't think I'm going to be able to get the tail on there. Because my, my fur is too thick. Which is really not a problem, if you think about it. Oh my cute! Oh my cute! And then I was thinking... Okay, no, that's not the kind of tails. Oh my yes, this is exactly what I was hoping to find, everyone. I have all sorts of ears. Halloween's the best time of the year, isn't it? I was like, am I seeing little spots? Or is that pet dander? It's pet dander. Let me move this. So I was really just trying on some stuff. I'm about to try this on. This is what I was supposed to be trying on. Look how pretty it is. And it has like a slit and then, but it's not steamed or anything. So it's just gonna be like, just to see if I like it. I tried this on and large child. Yeah, that would make sense. It's really tiny. I might put a little clip of it here in the end just so you can kind of see what it looks like, but I'm definitely getting rid of this. This isn't gonna fit. It, I can dream all day. Like it does fit, but it doesn't. I don't like how it looks. How about that? This kind of doesn't fit. This was harder to put on than this, but it feels better on. And I feel like a total cutie pie. Okay, well that tag's gotta go. Anyways, I thought I would put, did I bring them? <laughs> I can't touch this because I can't touch this. Do, 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 because I messed it up. I broke it again, my ring light. So anyways, I know somebody that has some lights that they can let me borrow for like making content and stuff, but I don't know if I should. Because what if I really like them and then I don't wanna give them back? You know what I'm saying? Then like the situation is real. The situation is real. Adorable. Other one, and I know like it would be cute with like heels or whatever, but I'm not wearing heels with this. Because the truth is, I like heels, okay? And I'm gonna put on heels with that blue dress. I might do a little clip, but I might not, you know, whatever. We got this clip. But the thing about heels is that I don't really like wearing heels anymore. Like I used to like thrive in them, but your girl for her 39th birthday is getting herself that laser treatment, the schlerotherapy for the little, like tiny little spider veins that I have, which for being a restaurant manager that used to work in heels 24 seven, like, I mean, not 24 seven, but like 16 to 18 hours a day. And then a hostess in Puerto Rico that used to also work like 12 hours in heels and then go party for like another six to eight hours in those heels. I think that I'm doing pretty well for being 39. But I'm at this age where I don't feel the need to wear heels, but I still like to wear them. Like I still like to dress up, but I don't go that many places. So it's like, where, where, why would I wear heels? But I'm the kind of person that used to go to Walgreens in heels or the grocery store. When I first moved here from Puerto Rico, people were like, girl, why are you wearing heels to the store? And then now I'm like, 
girl, why are you wearing heels to the store? Because, you know, but anyways, flats are my jam. My favorite thing are Ugg sweater boots. I've had them for years, you know, and sometimes I buy them secondhand and everything because I love them so much, but the soles are starting to wear out. So I'm gonna have to start like venturing out and like finding other designs and things that I like as well, you know? But anyways, I also like my new like Doc Martens. I've been wearing them a lot. Uh, well, <laughs> I say that. I wore them a lot when I got them. And then um, they were hard to break in. Like I'm still breaking them in. But then um, I had a calf injury. No, I really don't like them with this. Maybe I should get the Docs. Okay. Anyways, I had a calf injury and I had to, uh, I had to stop wearing them. I don't even want to do this. I'm going to run and get the shoes. I'm so sorry that I'm going to be off the screen. I might cut it off. I might just leave it because I don't want this to fall. Stand by. Sorry about that. <laughs> yeah. The dots, baby. I need to start breaking these in some more. How pretty are these? I love these so much. I've always wanted these shoes. Like, I always wanted them, and then I had them on my wish list, and then somebody got them for me. I'll never be grateful. Speaking of the person that got them for me, I feel so bad because we used to be friends on Instagram, right? And the best way to get a hold of me is Instagram, but that doesn't mean I'll actually answer. <laughs> I'm horrible at answering people. I love it with these. That looks really hot. Anyways, I'm horrible at answering, but sometimes I'll go ahead and answer. And then once, the thing about answering requests is that once you answer them, like you get every message they send you. Like it's, there's no filtering it out, you know? But anyways, I get freaked out when people unsend their messages. Cause I'm like, okay, why are you unsending them? That's weird. You know what I'm saying? So I blocked this person and it wasn't him who once sent them. And then I did a little reflection and I thought, well, I've once sent things before too. You know what I'm saying? And not like I, I wasn't planning on doing anything weird. I just was embarrassed by some of the things I sent or just wanted to unsend them, you know, just forever because embarrassment, you know, pride, vanity, whatever it is. So yeah i really like this outfit i just wanted to show you guys really quick um, but anyways it's fine if you send me messages and you unsend them but if we're going to be talking a lot just know that unsending messages makes me uncomfortable okay even though i've done it before too that's all i'll just say about that this is so cute these actually feel a little broken in and is this a scuff i see look see oh no anyways funny story is that um these got delivered to my old apartments instead of the new ones and the person that sent them to me was able to get a refund and sent me another pair so i have two pairs of these yay so i can like beat these up and then have a whole new pair which makes me so happy because when i have a like when i have a favorite pair of shoes i like to have more than one you know of the same shoe like i don't care I really don't care. I will wear the same shoes every day, but have like seven pairs of them, you know? I'm the same way about like pants, you know? I'm so weird. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Comiendo la colita. I really don't like this thing though. Can I rip it out? Yes, perfect. Anyways, gracias por estar aquí. I'll see you guys soon. Me boy, me boy. Bye.